This is a CBS 11 News First Alert Weather Day Update. Well, good afternoon, everybody. I'm meteorologist Jeff Ray. A quick update on what's going on out there. Treacherous driving conditions have been the story here so far this morning and early afternoon. Let me bring you an update on radar. Now, we had this really brief, well, not that brief, a couple of hours of heavy sleet fall over the Metroplex. Now that is over our eastern counties. As we look in a little bit closer across the metro area, we are seeing still some spatterings of light rain, freezing rain, and sleet going on. There is even a little snow in the mix there. You can see the heavy amounts now have left Kaufman, but are getting into Canton. So you're going to, in Canton, you, I know it's been not that bad of a morning until this arrived. And now you're going to have about 30 minutes of some heavy precipitation falling. You can see temperatures on roads are below freezing or out of freezing around the metro area. So that's why everything that's falling is sticking as ice on the ground. So it's a first alert weather day. Thunder, sleet, and freezing rain still part of the forecast. It goes on for a couple more days. In fact, all the way till Thursday morning. I see could accumulate on all surfaces, bridges, overpasses, and roads as well. On Wednesday, we think there'll be a couple of rounds of this. On Thursday, I think there'll be a round of it in the morning. Then we'll get some rain on Thursday afternoon as it finally gets above freezing. It's below freezing now. We'll not get above freezing again until we get to Thursday afternoon. More ice on the way. It's a first alert weather day today, tomorrow, and Thursday. Notice Thursday we're in the 40s, but until then, temperatures are just going to be very cold. The last six hours shows the story. Look at that heavy precipitation come in, and it, boy, it, it added up quickly. Half an inch to an inch of this frozen stuff fell on the ground. Now, for the afternoon, we'll, we'll continue to get waves of this of mostly light amounts. Same story through the overnight. But it looks like tomorrow is just a rinse and repeat with more heavy precipitation coming in through the day. The First Alert weather team is going to be keeping you posted every hour here on CBS 11. But if you're joining us on the stream right now, stay with us. We'll be back in just a few moments. This has been a CBS 11 News First Alert Weather Day Update.